The universe sent us a message, one that traveled over 13 billion years across the expanding fabric of space-time. It wasn't written in words, but in faint ancient stretched out light, a postcard from the cosmic dawn. For ages, we lacked the tools to receive it, peering at the night sky, but missing the universe's baby pictures, hidden in the mists of time. The first light of the universe, stretched by cosmic expansion, became a faint infrared whisper. Our telescopes were tuned to the wrong frequency, missing the earliest secrets. We needed a machine sensitive enough to read this ancient light, a story of the first stars and galaxies, the blueprints of everything. To see this light is to look back in time to when the universe was just a few hundred million years old. Unlocking this message is cosmic archaeology. So, humanity set out to build an extraordinary eye, powerful enough to pierce the cosmic fog and capture whispers from the beginning of time. We wanted to witness the universe's lights turning on. Our own origin story. On Christmas Day 2021, we launched our reply, a golden-eyed marvel sent to meet that ancient light and translate its story for us. The cosmic conversation was about to begin, the universe had waited billions of years to tell its tale, now we were finally ready to listen. The stage was set for a new era of discovery, and the first message was about to arrive. Meet the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST. Not just another telescope, but a masterpiece of human ingenuity, designed to see the universe's dawn. Its giant gold-plated mirror is built to reflect faint ancient infrared light. To do this, JWST must stay incredibly cold. Minus 233 degrees Celsius, shielded by a five-layer sunshield the size of a tennis court. Folded like cosmic origami, it traveled 1.5 million kilometers to a stable Lagrange point, always keeping the sun, earth and moon behind its shield. There it unfolded, cooled and opened its golden eye to the darkness. Unlike Hubble which sees mostly visible and ultraviolet light, JWST is tuned to the infrared, peering through cosmic dust and seeing the oldest objects in the universe. It's our superpower, the ability to witness the birth of the first galaxies, we sent it out with clear expectations, confident in our models, but the universe had surprises in store. The first images would challenge everything we thought we knew. JWST was about to rewrite the story of cosmic origins. The adventure was just beginning. Our golden eye was open, and the cosmos was ready to reveal its secrets. Before Webb, our story of the early universe was clear, built on the Lambda CDM model. After the Big Bang came the cosmic dark ages, no stars, no galaxies, just darkness. Slowly the first stars formed, then clumped into small, irregular baby galaxies. Our models predicted a gradual buildup, tiny huts before cities, small galaxies before giants. We expected JWST to confirm this, finding faint messy galaxies forming 500-600 million years after the Big Bang. The plan point web at the darkest sky, collect ancient light, and find evidence of slow, bottom-up galaxy formation. We were ready to celebrate our model's accuracy. We expected to see the seeds of the modern universe, small, faint smudges of light. But, the universe had a different story to tell. JWST was about to deliver a cosmic bombshell. The evidence would challenge our most fundamental assumptions. The early universe was not as we imagined. Our theories were about to be tested. The search for cosmic origins was about to take a dramatic turn. The universe was ready to surprise us, and we were about to listen. The real story was just beginning. The first JWST images stunned scientists. Instead of tiny faint baby galaxies, we saw massive, bright, well-formed galaxies, monsters in the cosmic nursery. Some looked like younger versions of the Milky Way, packed with stars and already mature. These galaxies existed just 300, 400 million years after the Big Bang. A cosmic blink. It was like finding a fully grown adult who claims to be two years old. The universe wasn't building brick by brick, it was raising skyscrapers overnight. Imagine expecting to find ancient villages, but unearthing a sprawling city instead. Astronomers were stunned, questioning everything they knew about cosmic history. These early giants directly challenged our understanding of how structures grow. The universe was far more advanced in its infancy than we imagined. This wasn't a minor tweak. It was a sledgehammer to our models. How could so much mass assemble so quickly? The light from these galaxies revealed mature stars, skipping cosmic childhood. The orderly picture of the early cosmos was shattered. Chaos and mystery replaced certainty. The universe's story was far more dramatic, and the questions were just beginning. 
the scientific world was electrified, excited, and confused. These early massive galaxies were dubbed universe breakers. They threatened to break our standard model of cosmology. Scientists double-checked everything, distances, masses, data. But the findings held, yo way. The galaxies were real, massive, and ancient. The problem wasn't the telescope, it was our theories. The universe was off script, revealing a new plot. Our Lambda CDM model, so successful elsewhere, struggled to explain these giants. It's like trying to fit an elephant into a shoebox. But this is the joy of discovery nature throwing a curveball. It's not failure, it's opportunity. The universe is more clever and surprising than we thought. The head scratching began. If our old story is incomplete, what's the new one? The race was on to solve the most exciting cosmic puzzle in a generation. The universe had rewritten the rules and we were eager to understand. How do you build a giant galaxy so fast? Scientists are exploring wild possibilities. Maybe the first stars were even bigger than we thought, behemoths that lived fast, died young, and collapsed into massive black holes. These black holes could have rapidly grown, fueling galaxy growth from the inside out. Perhaps galaxy formation was simply more efficient, gas cooling and collapsing into stars at record speed, Maybe early supernovae didn't slow things down as much as we believed. Or perhaps the universe's gas taps were wide open, letting galaxies bulk up quickly. It's humbling. We may have underestimated the universe's efficiency, or maybe our entire cosmological model needs revision. Could dark matter behave differently? Did the Big Bang give an extra push? JWST didn't just find new galaxies. It opened a new frontier in physics. The fundamental rules of the universe are up for debate, the cosmic recipe is being rewritten, and the search for answers is on. Where does this leave us? In awe, with more questions than answers, the universe is wilder, more creative and more mysterious than we imagined. JWST has pulled back the curtain, revealing a landscape of wonders. These universe breakers are gifts, signposts to deeper understanding. This is the spirit of exploration building machines, seeking the unknown and asking the universe to surprise us. The universe's childhood was more dramatic and productive than we knew. Every discovery spawns new mysteries, dark matter, black holes, early planets, even the possibility of ancient life. We are living in a golden age of discovery, decoding our own origins. The quest to understand the universe is one of humanity's noblest pursuits. JWST is more than a machine. It's our collective curiosity made real. The revelations will keep coming, the universe will keep surprising us, and we will keep looking up, ready for the next message from the dawn of time. The story's just beginning, and what a story it's turning out to be.